So this is the second of the houses I had. You're still visiting in New York one day. Yeah, well, sure. <laughs> all right, all right, all right. Um, so tell me about this, this, the Atlas Underground. Sure. Thing. When did it start? Sure. Uh, this is a problem that I've been with a problem. <laughs> in some ways, it was a problem. I've been working on this record in secret for years now, yeah. maybe for like four years. It was prior to Promise of Rage, even though the end of the Bruce Springsteen stage, right. I was working on this record. Um, and I had an idea to create a sonic conspiracy. That was the notion. To bring together artists of diverse genres, ethnicities, ages, and genders to make like this cohesive statement in 2018. And the lofty ambition was to create a new genre of rock and roll, something that com combined my Marshall Speck rocking, riffing, yep. soloing power with huge EDM drops and yep. some of the electronic wizardry of now. So uh, the journey began with I, when I, I got turned on to a band called Nice Party. And I, I, was, I was never a fan of EDM music. It always sounded like Italian taxi cab music. It's yeah. pretty awful. Um, until I, a, a metal friend turned me on to Nice Party, and they had the same power and aggression and tension and relief of some of my favorite rock and roll music. I thought, and the light bulb went on. I said, okay, what if... I was looking for a way to challenge myself as a guitarist and I said, so what if we take kind of what they do, but we replace their synthesizers with my electric guitar? Right. And we made a song, and it's the first song I learned called Battle Science. I'm like, this is like a new thing. So I just kept drill drilling down that path. And with some collaborators as diverse as Wu-Tang Clan and Marcus Mumford, yeah. Rise Against, Steve Aoki, Bass Nectar. Chay Flavig Mensa. Chay Flay, Big Boy, Killer Mike. Um, and, you know, made a record that was with some of my favorite new artists, some of my favorite people, artists, uh, to make something brand new for 2018. Well, nobody gets to even say that you're, you're, you're doing anything other than you've already done because a younger generation may not quite remember the conversations around rage when it first happened.